everybody. So glad you're with us. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to Boardwalk Hall and the famed Atlanta. Everybody's been waiting for these two to meet up. Now they do as round one is underway. Not able to land the headshot. You buy a ticket to a Joe Frazier fight, you have grand expectations. Yeah, you have expectations that you're not going to be going to get a hot dog or going to get a soda. You better sit in your seat, have your eyes glued, because he's coming out after that man. To the head he goes with a left hand. Right to the head with that right. He missed with that head shot. Fires off that hook. If you are the fighter with the lower stamina, and you know it, going up against a guy who can really go the distance, how do you go after it right from the gate? Well, I don't know that you go after it right from the gate, because then you're basically telling your opponent, I have no chance. I'm desperate. I think you go out there looking like you're ready to go the distance. Maybe he'll start to slow things down a little bit and worry about the late rounds himself. Good block by Joe Frazier. Frazier's pranked by an uppercut. Well, supposed to be fighting, but instead he's hugging. Nice work to the midsection with the left. Very nice work to the head. The right hand landed. And now looking to hang on. Huge uppercut from Smoking Joe. Crashes home with the uppercut. See how he targets that hook? Frazier's well off the mark that time. Joe and Teddy with you here in between rounds. A round in which, boy, he really just dominated his opponent. Teddy, he's got to think things could be coming to a sensational ending for him when he gets off the screen. Well, he's showing that to you right now. I'm looking at him right now, and he's starting to get up. There's a couple seconds left. There's probably five seconds left before he has to get up, and he's getting up early. That shows you right what you're talking about. He can't. He's chomping at the bid. He's confident. Teddy, what would you recommend based on what we're seeing here today? Well, two aspirin and then go, oh no, actually I would say a little counterpunching would be just what the doctor ordered. That's a better prescription for him. Up top with the right hand. Lands a big hook. Now hugging on the inside. Good job with the left hand. It was sudden, it was fast, it was direct by Joe Frazier. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Joe Frazier. Joe Frazier's nailed by a huge uppercut. See, that's what you want from his left hand. That's exactly what it should be doing, that left hand by Joe Frazier. Back and forth exchange. Oh, what an uppercut. A stabbing right hand comes in by Joe Frazier. Unable to score with the uppercut that time. Liston's landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. End of the round of what has been a very close and highly competitive fight. Teddy, how do you see this right now? I see it almost dead even. And I see whoever finishes the rounds, because in these kind of tight rounds, if you finish up good, the judges remember that. Oh, he turns it over right into a hook. Boy, that worked out well with the uppercut. A well-placed left hand up top. Frazier's speed to me, Teddy, is clearly the biggest difference we've seen so far tonight. Yeah, but there's ways to take away speed. One is to go downstairs to the body, 
and start to discourage the guy a little bit. You know, take some of the air out of those sails. That's a big uppercut that just crashed home. Good shot to the head with that right hand. Solid hook upstairs. And he's holding. 90 seconds to go in the fight. Look at that combination by Joe Frazier. Oh, you see him with the left of the head there? Liston's right hand did a nice job that time. That worked well for him. He really digs in when he decides to throw that uppercut. Good job. Nice strike after on. catching one by Joe Frazier. Oh, what a big hook from Joe Frazier. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. Step to the side and then lands the counter. Yeah, just appear on him, and then all of a sudden appear on him. home in the last 10 seconds of this final round. Oh, that's a good hook to the body. Which way will it go? Let's find out by sending it up to the ring announcer. So a unanimous decision win by Joe Frazier. That's the way we saw it all night long. The judges agree.